Hello again. Got a quick little video for you this time. Today we're going to talk about skyboxes. So uh, you might infer from the name that we're going to be talking about what we see up here at the top in the sky. Uh, now, in a game, we have this kind of 3D representation of a world. And we can see everything on the ground looks kind of the way we'd expect, but up in the sky you've got this kind of gray box, and that's really not very exciting. So we're going to go ahead and put in a more interesting sky. Now, the thing about skies and sky boxes is that by default, your project doesn't have any assets uh, that's, you know, image files and stuff uh, to give you a sky. You've got to get a picture of a sky into your project. So what we're actually going to do is import some assets that we can use. So we're going to go to the Assets menu and choose Import Package Sky Boxes. And that is going to import some sky boxes for us. We can even see this window comes up. It says, hey, do you want to import all this stuff? And yes, we want all of it. Every single thing. This might take a little while, but we're going to let that import. And it's importing all these TIFF files. Now, TIFF files are images. If any of you use a Mac, you might be familiar with TIFFs. Uh, so we're importing all these TIFF files. And now we've got them. So you'll notice if I open up my standard assets folder right down here under project, I have this skyboxes folder that I didn't have there before. If I open it up, I can see all these different skyboxes. And there's some preview pictures of what they look like. I have a few options for adjusting them, but these are basically all the skyboxes that are available for me here. Here's all the textures that make them up. So each skybox is made up of six textures because it's actually the inside of a box, which would have six sides. So um, each texture goes together to make up these skyboxes. And I also have skybox info, which tells you a little bit about skyboxes if you want to learn about them. But now we have everything we need to add a skybox. So to do that, we are going to go to the edit menu, we're going to go to render settings. So render settings is where your skybox is going to be. And here's all the stuff that has to do with rendering. And if I look down here, here's skybox material right there. So I can go ahead and open that up by pressing the little circle. And I can choose my skybox material. So as I click on these, I'm going to look at all the different skies that I can have. I can have kind of overcast skies. I can have uh, eerie skies. I can have normal skies. This one's pretty cool. And there's even materials in here that aren't really meant for skies, so they could be crazy and weird, like palm tree branches. Not really what we're going to be looking for. So let's go for, where's that one? I like this one. Let's go for that. I can just double click on it, and now I've got a nice pretty skybox for my game. And there it is. That's how you apply a skybox.